Hello everyone, welcome back to Crack So It. It's day 6 of 30 days challenge and I'm back with a new video. And in today's video, I'll tell you about kernel SU and also discuss top 3 advantages and disadvantages of kernel SU on Android phones. So without further ado, let's start. Kernel SU is a new and powerful method of routing Android devices that has gained popularity recently. It is a kernel based root solution which means it runs in the kernel, the core of the operating system. This gives kernel SU more control over the system than other routing methods that runs in user space. User space is the part of the operating system that runs apps and other programs. So I hope you understand what kernel SU is. Now let's talk about top 3 advantages and disadvantages of kernel SU. Use banking apps on a rooted phone without worry. If you have rooted your phone with kernel SU, the major advantage you gain is the ability to use banking apps easily without any problems. This is because kernel SU does not let the phone know that it is rooted. It achieves this through a technique called root cloaking. Root cloaking hides the fact that a device is rooted from apps and other software. When you install kernel SU, it creates a list of apps allowed to have root access called the su.prop file. When an app attempts to access root, kernel SU checks the su.prop file to determine if the app is permitted root access. If the app is not in the su.prop file, kernel SU will deny the request. Get better performance and battery life. Kernel SU can enhance the performance of your device by optimizing the kernel for your specific hardware. It requires a specific kernel that supports kernel SU. If you are a developer, you can create a custom kernel for your device and integrate it with kernel SU. While making a kernel, you can adjust settings to overclock the CPU, improving speed or optimize power uses to enhance battery life. Kernel SU can also optimize the kernel for power efficiency, further improving battery life. There are some popular kernels that have performance and battery optimizations that work with Kernel SU. You can use that too. Increased security. Kernel SU uses a white list access control system, allowing only specific apps granted root permission to access SU. This improved security by preventing malicious apps from gaining root access. To illustrate, think of it as installing a security system in your house that permits entry only to individuals on a whitelist, preventing unauthorized access. So these are the top 3 advantages of Kernel SU. Now let's discuss the top 3 disadvantages of Kernel SU. Complex installation process. Kernel SU is undoubtedly a great method for routing but is more complex to install than other routing methods. It also requires some technical knowledge to use. You or a developer must build a custom kernel for your device that supports kernel SU. Mistakes during the installation process could damage your device. Additionally, if you decide to unroot your device, then it can be challenging to undo the changes, requiring a full device restoration. I recommend taking a backup before attempting any such modifications. You can also check my video in the description section for a proper guide on installing kernel SU and routing your phone. Not compatible with all devices. Another major disadvantage of kernel SU is that it is not compatible with all Android devices. It relies on a separate kernel that must support kernel SU. As this is a new method, not all devices have kernel SU supported kernels available. You may need to wait for developers to create compatible kernels for your device. And there is no guarantee that your device will be supported. The kernel SU developers have a compatibility list of devices known to work with kernel SU which you can find on the kernel SU website. If your device is not on the list, it is not guaranteed that kernel SU will work on your device. If you are uncertain about compatibility, it's best to avoid using kernel SU to prevent potential issues including breaking your device. Limited modules available. Kernel SU is a relatively new routing method resulting in a fewer available modules compared to other methods like Magisk. As kernel SU gains popularity, more developers may create modules for it. 
The main reason for the limited number of modules is kernel ASU's newness. It has been around for a shorter time than other methods like MAGISC, allowing less time for module development. Kernel ASU being a kernel based root solution is more challenging to create modules for compared to methods like MAGISC, which do not modify the kernel. Additionally, MAGISC has a larger developer community resulting in a wider variety of available modules. So these are the top three advantages and disadvantages of using kernel as you. So I hope you found this video informative and if you did, then don't forget to hit the like button, comment down below, share this video and subscribe to Cracksway YouTube channel. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.